Uh, it's cold today and I want to keep things really simple. I'm a really simple kind of guy. Let me show you how simple I am. I love simple food like apples. Hands up if you like apples. They're yeah, great things. Uh, I like reading books. Hands up if you like books. <laughs> Terrific. Yeah, great call over there. I like wearing really simple shoes. Hands up if you like simple shoes. Okay, don't touch my shoes. Things on them aren't so simple. I like writing with a pen rather than typing at a computer. Hands up if you guys like writing. Yeah, not always. Hands up if you like getting letters from people like grandmas. And Yeah, writing is great. So I like really simple things. So when it comes to what God says about life, I like something really simple. I'm going to read to you something really simple. And then I'm going to teach you a way to remember it. Okay? So I want you to listen carefully. Here's something really simple. For I passed on to you as most important what I also received, that Christ died for our sins according to the Scriptures, that he was buried, that he was raised on the third day according to the Scriptures. Do you know what? That's a summary of the whole Bible. And you can remember the whole Bible with five fingers. Hands up if you've got five fingers on one hand. Okay, I want you to hold those fingers up Okay, because this is the gospel high five. I know that's a really daggy phrase, but it's simple. Okay, So I want you to remember this. Jesus died. Jesus was buried. Jesus rose for my sins according to the Bible. That's the whole Bible in five fingers. Do you reckon we can do that together? All right, I'll do it one more time, and then I want you to yell it out. So all those people back there who struggle with listening can hear it with us, okay? So Jesus died, Jesus was buried, Jesus rose for my sins according to the Bible. All right, can we yell that out? Yes. All right, we want to yell it. Actually, I want you guys to turn around and face all them, okay? And let's stand up, actually. We'll stand up because we've learned it up the front. And we want all of them out there to hold up a hand. Hold up a hand. This is the simple stuff. And I want you to grab your other hand and your pointer finger. That's your pointer finger. That's the good finger. Okay? And we're going to do it together. We're all going to say it. Jesus died. Jesus was buried. Jesus rose for my sins according to the Bible. So let me tell you, Grab a seat, boys and girls, and I'll, I'll keep talking to you while they listen in. Let me tell you, you can share the good news about Jesus with anyone because you've always got your fingers with you. And so when you meet someone, you can shake their hand and say, G'day, my name's Bernard. What's yours? I'll tell you their name's Bruce. And then you go, G'day, Bruce. You just shook hands with the Bible. Let me share it with you. Jesus died. Jesus was buried. Jesus rose. For my sins, according to the Bible. So life's pretty simple. And that's a simple summary of what God says in the whole Bible. I'm going to see if you can remember that next week. Okay? In fact, I reckon, I reckon we can show the bishop that next week. What do you reckon? Okay? Five things, and it's all on your hands, and God's message of good news is that simple. How about I pray, then we're going to do some sheets. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you that you are simple. You simply love us. You simply sent your son. His name is Jesus. And he died, was buried and rose for our sins according to your plan. Thank you for that good news. Help us to trust it and help us to share it. In Jesus' name, amen.